If you're buying a property off the plan, you need to consider there's only two ways to do this and do it well. The first one is if you're buying off the plan from a developer or the person you're buying off, the vendor, and they're motivated. And being motivated from a developer's perspective is getting pre-sales. So pre-sales are before the developer actually starts building. So that can be one way to get a really good bargain off the plan, providing that you're not being oversold off the plan through a project marketer, where the project marketer takes a big fee. So a lot of project marketers make five or 6% commission. So you don't wanna be buying directly off a project marketer. You hopefully wanna be buying directly off the developer or off a casual real estate that agent who's only going to be charging a 2% fee. The other way is to buy in a highly restricted market where you're buying off the plan and in two years time, that market is going to have grown a lot. Now you are market dependent, so this isn't going to be as robust as the first plan, but it is a way to make a lot of money putting a five or 10% deposit down. And then in two years time, whatever that is, then you settle on the property and you settle it with a lot of equity. That's the only ways I would buy off the plan.